fire has always been an iconic element across the most memorable moments in film history. In this video, you'll learn how we filmed burning fire and explosions on a miniature set we built from scratch, and how we were able to capture everything in super slow-mo to achieve crazy Hollywood-looking scenes. Let's fire things up and dive straight in. So when we wanted to add unique cinematic flames for the Artlist footage catalog, we knew CGI wouldn't cut it. Only real fire would have that wow factor. From the beginning, our main motivation was this huge challenge of capturing dramatic fiery scenes using only practical effects in 1000 FPS slow-mo. Unedited one shots, one takes, one camera. Phantom cameras are usually used to shoot food and drink footage, but you rarely see them being used to shoot fire. So we went all out this time. In this production, we envisioned an apocalyptic desert environment. These are four main scenes we had in mind. A burning house, a burning tree, explosive reaction of sand and dust, and a giant fireball, all to be captured in stunning detail. If you want to make any scene feel huge, going miniature with your set design is the way to go. We knew that the key ingredient for capturing truly massive fire effects was to start small in scale. Small house, small tree, small risk. Our team of set designers constructed intricately detailed miniature landscapes, allowing our pyrotechnicians to unleash while maintaining full control. Having less production space to work with, we could channel our efforts into making the fire as intense and fierce as possible. Creating the perfect flames requires the perfect recipe. Our special fire technicians use flammable glue, dry ice, gasoline, and ignition devices to make flames dance just how we like. Bright one moment, swirling shadows the next. And since the Phantom needs so much light, we had to walk that tightrope between overexposing the blaze and losing all the drama in the darkness. But no matter how many tests were made, you just can't predict the results. Creating an explosion incredible enough to meet our big vision wasn't possible with just one blast. We knew that to get this massive mesmerizing effect, we'd need to film not one, but many separate fiery bursts and fuse them together. Executing each detonation precisely took serious planning and care. This is how we broke it down. First, an air cannon shockwave. We utilized a high-powered air cannon to generate debris from the shockwave. Bursting air delivered a widespread whoosh of dust and sand, simulating a blast radius. Then, upward erupting flames. We triggered a vertical fire eruption. Managing the gas output was key. The flame needed to be big enough to fill the frame, but not too big, so that it overpowers the background. Finally, one last bang to tie it all together. Nothing about making this vision real came easy. It meant long hours of complex setups and loads of test shots. Managing the gas output was key. Was it worth it? See for yourselves. Be sure to check out the finished footage on artlist.io and see how you can spark up any of your videos.